All right, we're back for day two, January 2020. Gonna get the cows fed. Did the water yesterday. Everybody's been up sick all night pretty much, but we'll keep moving on here. It's gonna have pretty much the same kind of days I did yesterday. We'll cut some wood after we're done here. Everything's froze up still. It's a little warmer today. About 34, so we'll get that. Let's get some more wood cut today. Back up, Minos. Come on, get back. Get back. Hey, get back. Get back. Come on, hey, get back. Stop. Hey, get back. Okay, so like I said before, we're gonna get dressed, go out, cut some firewood. Damn, chest cold. Feel a little down. Get working a little bit, feel a little better, hopefully. Okay, so this is day two of the new year, 2020. We're back out to cut more firewood. Remember, we left off yesterday up here. Just keep working this area. That's what we're gonna be working on today. It appears where we finished our pile at yesterday. Maybe we'll be coming off the field. Got some tops in there, we got cleanup still. As I said yesterday, I'm going to continue working on this road. Get down to my shooting house. We got two big trees and one small one right here. They get up today, hopefully. Got a small one right here. Got two larger trees down there. Get through those today will be an accomplishment. And we'll probably stack the wood somewhere over in here so it's easy to get to off the road. What we're looking for over in here, you'll see a lot of these. I don't know if you can see it that well, but there's a lot of small trees and stuff, and that's what the deer nibble the buds off of. Kind of hard to tell, but you can see they've ate these down. Tops are already nibbled off them. But open up the floor of the woods here and hopefully we'll have a lot of new growth coming in. If copper doesn't stomp it all down. So one of the things I'm doing is when I go through, I'm selectively cutting the trees that, I'm no tree expert either, but selectively cutting the trees that I don't think are gonna have much value down the road. So I'm leaving a lot of the hardwoods behind that are nice and straight, but I kinda go through them as I go. This is a good example here, this maple tree right here. It's kinda split down here at the base, two, and then as you go up, I mean, a lot of times I'll take the smaller of the two off and angle it away from the original. So you can see this one had the top broke out of it at one time. Up here. So, the other one beside it isn't going to be much good by the time I kill that one off. I mean, I may get a couple more years out of it. So, I will say I may let the smaller one go for a little bit, but that also has a branch. It splits into two up here, so we'll get that removed out of the way. As long as we're right here.
picked up that old dead thing. That's not it. No, it's over there. Copper, over there. Focus in, see if we can see. The shooting house is right down there. Got the road opened up. 
dad came up and helped me today. Got a lot of wood cut today. Stack there. That stack up there. Copper help. Don't you? Did you help? Did you help today? Yeah, you got wood, didn't you? You got wood for everybody. That's it. We're carrying it. It's time to pick up. Head on in. Saying be all you can be You gotta keep the truth in your heart Believe when you can't see You don't see the sign Give it time Won't reach the top without the climb Good day today. Got a lot of firewood cut for next year, year after. Got the road opened up that I wanted to get done. I got the cattle fed. And now we're gonna head home, spend some time. I'd like to thank you all for watching. If you'd like to subscribe, go ahead. Click like. Me and Copper will see you next time. Ready, Copper? Good? And even when it gets hard, I promise not to quit and It feels so good to be alive, it feels so good you're by my side